Seven days out, and my body is broken. <laughs> Seriously, guys, the grind is real. The grind is so real. I've come to terms with the fact that normal for me now is uncomfortable. It literally is, man. This last, the last two weeks of this diet, I'm actually. Funnily enough, I'm not even counting calories because all I'm trying to do is have as least amount of carbs as possible and basically go through the day with at le the least amount of calories as possible. It's, it's got to that point, like macros don't even matter anymore. I'm just trying to hit 2,000 calories or under um, worth of food. And also I'm trying to hit about at least three, three and a half thousand worth of um, calories burnt so yeah I've definitely been tightening up which is what I was hoping would happen but it hasn't been too easy man it hasn't been easy at all um, I said 10 days out that I was going to do a full week of low carb well it's now seven days out and um, I just couldn't do it man I did it for the first day and then on with nine days out I, I, I was just like nah man I'm feeling so shit already like I literally can't do this for another um, week straight so I stopped didn't go overboard or anything but basically just ate like my normal diet normal cutting diet probably about 200 grams of carbs for those two days and then today we're at seven days out and this is when it really starts I've just gone basically the whole day at work with a fucking stressful client man it's one thing you need in my job is patience and if you <laughs> if you're hungry Patience is is very hard to come by, but you got to do what you got to do. And I knew that this week was going to be tough, and uh, I'm actually enjoying it to be honest with you. Like, it's not, you know, it's fucking peak week, baby. It's peak week. One week out, man. So I've been practicing posing and stuff, but uh, yeah, as I said, energy levels are fucking low. I've finished work. I'm going to the gym. Yesterday I hit legs. My legs are sore as fuck, but it was the second to last leg workout before before the comp, so went hard and I've only got one more to go. And I'll tell you what, this next leg workout, whether I'm tired, whether I'm fasted, whether I'm, doesn't matter what I am, man, I'm gonna go hard as fuck on these last workouts. Hard as fuck. <sighs> so first thing before I go to the gym, I'm gonna stop at the supermarket, I'm gonna get some low carb foods, to keep me going, some nice ones, different different types. I'll be smashing the low carb protein bars lately, which is not a good idea. Um, really, it's kind of been messing with my gut a bit. I've had cramps for the first time ever, stomach cramps. Um, yeah, muscle soreness is just at another level. Yeah, but hey, you got to smile and grin and bear. Smile and bear it. Smile, grin and bear it. You gotta grin and bear it, and that's what I'm doing. So, let's go to the supermarket, guys. I'll show you what I get when I'm done. All right, guys, so we got the groceries, and just before I show you what I got, um, I'm just stopping at my sister's place to pick up my electronic scale because I haven't had that for ages and ages, and I need it. So, let's see if she's home. Gonna surprise her. Yo, what's up? Is anyone here? Oh, hey. Yo, yeah, I think you're face somewhere. Yeah. Who, who's your mate? Oh, oh. Well, thanks for that. No worries. Oh, I'm not fucking. Are you? Better go. 
serious? Maybe. Why? Well, I turned it off when I went out there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That is that done. I actually also picked up my laptop because not only was the Wi-Fi shit back in New Zealand, but come home to Australia and we've got dial-up speed Wi-Fi. So there's no way I can upload a gigabyte fucking video on dial-up because it'll take, I think it said it was going to take about 15,000 minutes. So dropped that off uh, the other night to my sister's place to upload a couple of videos. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to take off home and when I get there I'll show you what I bought from the supermarket and go through the macros and everything. Because I'm not going to the gym right now, I'm going to go to the gym after because really I don't have the energy. Alright guys, a little bit of a change of plan from <laughs> where I left you yesterday. I. Uh, I ended up staying at my sister's place for like three or four hours. Um, they had dinner there, I had a little bit. Too many carbs, went over what I wanted to do. So basically, we're sitting at six days out now. It's Sunday, it's crunch time, baby. And it's definitely low carb uh, starting today. So, what's today? Sunday, we're going Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, low carb we're under 100 grams. I'm not going to go zero because it's literally impossible for me. It is fucking impossible. I cannot do four days of chicken and vegetables. Um, no. So yeah, under 100 grams, I'm, as well as weight training, um, I'm pretty sure I will deplete myself of most of the glycogen in my system and then come Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday morning, we're going to be carving up as well as dehydrating. And Saturday morning, baby, that's showtime. I've got my posing routine sorted, which I'll show you guys in another video, but um, I'm really, really stoked that I've got that sorted because that was that was stressing me out for a little bit there. Um, but I've got the perfect tea walk sorted, so yeah, won't go too much into that, but um, a lot of aesthetic Ziz style posing rather than the whole fist clenched sort of thing so feeling really positive about that but uh, basically off to work now I'm feeling hungry as per usual in my bag with me I've got some aminos I've got two low carb protein bars and I've got some egg whites so yeah get to work try and get through my whole day on just that um, and that's 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 how I that's how I've stuck to the diet guys is I go to work for like a nine or ten hour shift with fuck all food and it's just like it's like starving myself but it's like it's what you need to do it's what I need to do with a week out from a show so that's what I'm doing and on the way home I'm gonna be starting a water load either today or tonight or tomorrow um, so I'm gonna be buying a shitload of water as well probably gonna be trying to have about eight liters a day and some days I honestly would have 8 litres a day just because it's so hot here but I'm going to make a point of drinking it as much as I can come Thursday I will be cutting it down come Friday will be very very minimal and Saturday morning well, who knows I'm, I'm probably going to be feeling shit but uh, it's, it's all going to be worth it because man, i got abs now and I just want to make them come out as much as possible for the show day so yeah first things first I'm gonna go get a coffee open up my eyes a little bit and then I'll be off to work again so <sighs> thanks for joining me guys I still haven't shown you guys what I got from the supermarket but I did get some good things and some things that have been staples throughout my entire diet um, which has been a long time now. So when I get home from work tonight, uh, I will show you guys what I bought, and yeah, that'll be it for another day. And I'll be back with you guys six days out. But until then, that's off to work. Gay. Okay.